Right, hey all, we are going to create a iPhone f anime video with subtitles from an MKV file and we're going to make it as small size as we can. First of all, these two, these two programs you're going to need. Xvid for PSP, which, you, which is you're going to have to install and you want MKV tool mix, which is from a RAR all I've done is extract it to my desktop and it's in the folder. Right. I'll provide the links in my description. So, right, open the install program. Right, we are going to open my first video, which I'm going to compress. I'm going to turn into a iPhone video. Right, okay. This will have no subtitles. As you can see. So, first of all, we are going to go to our MKV tool and we're going to find MKV extract GUI. Double click that, go to your import, find the video you are wanting. Open it, find subtitles, tick it, and extract. When you've clicked extract, the subtitles will go straight to here underneath your video. But obviously, I've so right, what I've done is I've created a subtitle folder and I've put it here. It'll come under track free because um, you have the tracks like the audio, the video and the subtitles and you can even get a track before you can have uh, Japanese audio where you can switch along and stuff like that so right so we have that subtitles add we've added the subtitles right brilliant okay <coughs> First of all, we are going to trim. We want to get rid of this. And we want to get rid of this. So, first of all, start your frames. So it's going to be at zero. That's the start. We are going to trim up to. Let's say that's. Uh, be a little bit more precise. Let's say that's the end of it. You can keep playing and pausing until you reach it. So. Okay, apply trim. We have now got all of the beginning. We are going to encode it and we are going to save that as one. So it doesn't, you don't have to do that, but it just means you know what. So that's the beginning of the film. So you're going to save it by done it. So, right. When that's done, and it'll tell you, just close close the encode fault, you know, screen, and then you want to go to remove trim. By the way, this is a very good point. You might want to look and see if your audio is in sync and the subtitles are in sync because this program can do it with some MKVs. So let's see. Brilliant. It's all in sync. Next of all, you want to get the second part, which is here. So we set that, and we're gonna. We want it to end. Yeah, that's the end of the thing. So we've now we're gonna apply the trim. We've trimmed out this part and this part, so apply trim, encode it, narrow to 2, save it, alright, we're done, close, next, movie maker, you need to, sorry, that doesn't matter, okay, 
you want to go to right basically you're gonna have your two files you can drag that then both there let's say that's my one so that's number one and then you want number two at the back of it so they both line up go to there save the movie and you want to go for computer not high de definition or anything for computer it'll keep it would be good quality so do that save it and that's my result go back here open grab your file now and straight into it no no stopping and stops okay we're en gonna encode it and just save it and you are done now to show you the finished products okay this is one which hasn't been touched okay quality is okay. really good for the iPhone that's really good and you can see that's at 65 KB so this is without trimming it if you want to trim it and keep your space on your iPod this is the shortened one no difference absolutely perfect so now we have them and that's how you pretty much do it if you have any questions just give me a post